Hi, this is Chanel from Tips and Tricks HQ and in this tutorial I'll demonstrate how you can email lock your downloads on a WordPress site. Email locking your downloads means that a user will have to enter a valid email prior to enjoying your digital content. You can then choose to use those emails for marketing purposes. Furthermore, email locking your downloads prevents spam bots from downloading on your site. To email lock downloads, we'll take a look at the free Simple Download Monitor plugin and the Premium Squeeze Form add-on. The plugin allows you to upload and monitor your downloads, while the add-on gives admin the capability to email protect their content. I have now arrived in my WordPress dashboard where I have the Simple Download Monitor and the Simple Download Monitor Squeeze Form installed and activated on my site. Once you have these installed and activated, You'll see a menu called Downloads, and under this menu you'll also see Squeeze Form. Before we email protect our download, we'll need to create a download. So I'll go to Downloads, and I'll click on that, and then I'll click on Add New. This will take me to the Add New Downloads page, where I'll need to enter in some details about my download. So I'll start by titling my download, and I'll also add a short description. Now that I've added a title and a description, I'll scroll down. It's here that I'll need to select the file that I'd like to offer as a downloadable item. So I'd click this select file button and I can pick my download. So I'll just be picking this wallpaper image and I'll click insert. I can also add a thumbnail to give my customers a bit of an idea about what they'll be downloading. So I'll go ahead and I'll add that image, but it'll just be a thumbnail size to give them a little bit of an idea. So I'll scroll down. I can add some other details about my download if I choose. And here is where the short codes are located. But for now, I think I'll just stick with a simple download and I'll publish that one out. Now that we've published out the download, we're ready to put this on a post or a page and then we can email protect it. So I'll be creating a page, add new, I can give it a quick title and then it's here that I can go to my SDM squeeze form, select my download item, so it's this wallpaper image, I can choose to select a fancy style and for this demonstration I will, so I'll need to pick one and I can adjust the button text. For now I'll leave it as download now. I'll click OK and that will enter in this nice little short code for me. So I've entered in the short code, I've given my page a title and I'm ready to publish. Now that my page has been published, I'll go ahead and I'll show you what it will look like. So I've got my page here. And this is my downloadable item that is protected by an email. So only users that come and enter their name and email will then be allowed to download the item. So I'll go ahead now and I'll show you how a user would download this wallpaper image. So I'd come in and I'd enter a name and I'd enter an email. And then I can go ahead and click the download now. So I can choose where I'd like to save this. Um, so I'll just save the file and I'll click OK. And my wallpaper image has been saved. In the case of a spam user that tries to come on and just click the download now button, they'll be given the message name is required. If they just enter in a name and they try and click the download now button, they'll still need to enter in an email. Now that we've created an email protected download, We'll take a look at where your users' emails that download this item are stored. So we'll need to head back to our WordPress dashboard. And under Downloads, Squeeze Form, we'll need to click on that. This takes us to the Squeeze Form Settings page. It's here that you can find the email addresses of those that download an email locked downloadable item. So this is the one that we just downloaded here. It was the downloadable wallpaper image. You can see that my first name has been recorded along with my email address. Admin can then choose to collect these emails in a MailChimp server if they wish. 
Email locking your downloadable items is a great way to stop spam bots from clogging your site, but is also another way to collect your users' email addresses for later marketing use. That brings me to the end of this tutorial on email locking downloads. I hope that you've learned how to email lock your own downloads on your WordPress site.